Kagura. I am the project manager at Zimbabwe Community, Zimbabwe, Zimbabwe Community Development Association. Um, we are carrying out a program to do the human traffic in migrant rights. We are doing it in seven districts. So far, we have uh, carried out some participatory planning workshop where we have come up with the district plans in response to human trafficking. Uh, we are working with the government departments, particularly the Home Affairs Ministry, the DA's office, the social services, health, education, as well as RRG's office, office and um, other interested stakeholders like the Women Affairs and Youth. So far, we have successfully carried out the participatory planning workshops where districts have recovered their own plan uh, in response to human trafficking. Out of the seven districts, six have uh, successfully done so. So we are on, now we are on a round of uh, crafting referral pathways in the district so that uh, the, whenever victims are identified or rescued, the district will be able to respond to help and provide support and to the victims in a manner that would ensure coordination and safety of the victims. We are doing this again with all relevant uh, arms of government at district level. So we hope this process will go smoothly and will be able to establish the referral pathways. The main key issue that our country planning is that there are some manifest and latent tendencies of trafficking that are happening internally in Zimbabwe. Some of them people are not aware that there are trafficking tendencies, especially issues to do the labor service issues, or recruiting young girls to work in brothels without their consent, or with their consent, but uh, uh, making them lose control. So this has been one of the main issues, or people being recruited to work in decent places internally, but when they visit these areas, they are not paid for their labor. So labor service is very rampant, and there are also some disturbing tendencies where people could be trafficked for uh, racial purposes. Yes, there are very disturbing tendencies. So we hope to carry out some awareness campaigns uh, to these, in, especially in the grassroots communities through cinematography, road shows. For these and other stories, visit our website www.263chat.com. Follow us on Twitter at 263chat and like our Facebook page 263chat.